so uh, hi friends uh, i am sanjeev here fr uh, from the research team uh, and tracking mainly the capital goods sector uh, so far as our outlook for the sector is concerned what we have seen in uh, this quarter especially from the numbers announced by the four uh, leading uh, uh, capital goods companies that is uh, lnt bhl uh, siemens and cgl and uh, crompton gives is uh, that uh, we have seen that uh, order intake uh, which is the leading indicator has declined uh, both on a year on year basis as well as on a quarter on quarter basis but uh, uh, digging deeper uh, we find that uh, much of the decline in order intake has been contributed by poor numbers from uh, bhl and uh, uh, excluding that uh, there has been an increase in order intake uh, uh, for the uh, other three companies, uh, even on a year-on-year -year as well as on quarter-on-quarter quarter, uh, quarter quarter basis, so uh, uh, it appears that uh, the uh, the worst for the capital goods uh, companies in terms of orders uh, may have bottomed out. Uh, that is what at least it appears right now. Uh, but it is. Uh, it's certain that uh, the power sector continues to go through very weak uh, uh, investment activity and very few uh, power generation projects are getting uh, finalized and hence BHL reported very uh, low numbers for the order intake in this quarter. Uh, apart from that, uh, so far as the physical indicators are concerned, the core sector industries uh, uh, grew at a very modest rate uh, for the month of December. Uh, basically a decline over November, uh, but uh, recovering from a negative uh, growth or a contraction in the October. So again here also we are finding that uh, the uh, there has been recovery, uh, but uh, the recovery has been uh, uh, very weak. Uh, so the capex cycle uh, for continues to be uh, very weak and uh, unless there are uh, broad reforms measure as well as some policy measures uh, uh, it, it appears that uh, the weak trends in the capex cycle would continue at least in the uh, near uh, near term so we expect uh, uh, reforms in the uh, power sector uh, restructuring of uh, state electricity boards or current uh, or uh, uh, land acquisition uh, uh, clearances and uh, uh, things on those front uh, could help uh, uh, the investment activity which has been stalled for quite some time. So, uh, so on an overall basis, uh, we, we see uh, 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 weak trends in the capital goods sector in the near term. Uh, the sector has outperformed in the month of January uh, after uh, reporting a significant uh, underperformance in the entire 2011. Uh, so, uh, however, we expect uh, the sector to uh, remain a market performer in the near term going ahead. Uh, so far as stocks are concerned, we prefer uh, project uh, companies over, we prefer product companies over uh, project companies and uh, our preferred uh, picks uh, would be uh, Bharat Electronics uh, uh, and uh, Greaves Cotton and also Larsen and Tubro and Cummins India Limited. That's it. Thank you.